GCPD evidence number 648, Scarecrow audio log, uh, Dr. Crane audio log number 50, uh, nature of the uh, evidence is graphic, so listen to discretion advised, I guess. Eh, sick fucker. This is Dr. Crane. Experimental log number 50. Oh, quite a milestone. I should have... Oh, I should have brought flowers or maybe a pizza. Either way, the subject of today's experiment is one Deborah Paulos who, it turns out, suffers from a very acute, yet still prevalent, case of eichnophobia, or a fear of sharp objects. Now, Miss Paulos is already quite scared, as I have her bound and gagged. Unfortunately, she lives in an apartment complex, so her screams cannot be analyzed in this experiment, but we will make do. Now, upon this base fear, let us see what happens when we introduce a bladed item into Miss Paulos's line of sight. Of course, the fear amplifies. Look at the blade, Miss Paulos. Look closely at its shine. Now, at the height of her fear, we will introduce the toxin. Panic is rushing through her now. What she sees, I wonder. Tell me, Miss Paulos. Tell me what you see. At the height of your fear, tell me what do you see. Stuck the blade into Miss Paulos's stomach, but she does not scream. My gosh, she can't. The fear is too complete. It has her. I can see it in her eyes, unblinking, bulging. She is trapped in her own mind. Endless fear, torment. Oh. What do you see? She is gone. Well, I think a bit more tinkering is to be done. As wonderful as it was, I don't think I want them going catatonic again. I think I would just like to hear them scream a bit longer.